What's up guys, Den Scorch here with part 19 of my vehicle making tutorial. Uh, we're nearing the end. Uh, so right here, we need to make a YTD file. Um, we're actually not going to find that in there, so we need to go mods, 64E, levels, GTA 5, vehicles, that are RPF. Scroll down. We'll just go with one of the first ones we find, which will probably be the Adder Plus, or Airbus Plus, either one. Uh, we're going to export that, then rename this to Econoline YTD, open it, delete the stuff that's in here. Import desktop Econoline textures. Control A. Let's click all that. Now we have our 28 textures. Make sure that number matches that number. If it doesn't, something went wrong. Um, and actually, why did we have to import this? Uh, view details. That. Is a PNG file. So, now that I noticed that, uh, vehicle generic Econoline interior. Oh, yeah, that's right, because I got rid of all that stuff. That's right. So, we're going to export that as a DDS. Uh, we're just going to save that. Then we're actually going to export that as well. Delete that. Take wherever the other one went. I think it's behind here. Um, we're going to delete the PNG. Move our DDS in here. Take that one, put that one back so that we have an Airbus that high and that put it all the way at the bottom just because it was a brand new import um, but we now have a YTD file uh, this we don't need anymore and that I copied so we don't need that anymore um, so now we go over up here and I have to Black you guys up for a sec while I reopen. That's not the right program. That is definitely not the right program. Come on, get it together. Come on. That's not the right program either. Jeez, what is going on? I don't know what I'm doing. Sorry about this, guys. Once I get my head screwed on straight and actually open the right file. Reopen our Econoline Z. Go over here to our textures. Go Econoline. And go to this one, which is not in DXT1 format. It's an RGB. And we just go replace Econoline textures. And vehicle, generic Econoline interior. And replace that. Now it's DXT5. And really the only thing that changed was the interior material. Um, so now, and if we put this, if we put the old YFTs into GTA, the interior will be invisible because, or, I'm, or at least I'm pretty sure it'll be invisible, uh, because it called for the interior, called for a PNG and not a DDS. So, regular kind of line, export, done. Underscore high. Export, not import. Done. I think the PNG was just higher quality. I mean, it's the same quality, I think it just takes up more space. So, we'll save that again. 
So now these three we can delete. That one is our Z3 file, and that is our high and our regular YFT. So now we open this up and go into our econ our mods update 64 DLC packs, Econoline DLC RPF times 64 vehicles dot RPF. And we just drag and drop that stuff in. And now we can view this in here. Don't be worried that it's all like black and the tires aren't in the right spot or anything like that. Completely normal. Absolutely completely normal. I really hope you can see through that in game. That'd be awesome. Um, those filters are really high quality. Anywho, uh, we can see that in there. Everything like that. Uh, I possibly did this already, but uh, update RPF common data DLC list. And no, it did not. So just copy a random line from in here. This will probably be something like DLC packs, MP stunt, or any of the patch days, or any other MP something or other. Um, and this is my, there we go, and just name this Conaline. This will call for the game to load the Econoline folder, which loads this DLC. Um, so therefore, all we have to do is fire up our Grand Theft Auto V. Yeah, this might load in three minutes. Probably not, but it might load in three minutes. You guys actually aren't getting any audio from this. Um, so, let's go over here and... Audio output capture at using the stop audio. Am I work now? Nope, yeah, it's not gonna work because it's the wrong thing. Properties. Um speakers. Okay. There we go. Uh can I rename this? We are going to remove, oh, rename, right there, right above remove. We're going to rename this, um, Headphone Audio. So now you guys can hear everything that goes on through my headphones. screwed all that stuff up. If it doesn't load in time, then, uh, oh, 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 it's gonna load! Alright, so now we need, like, train ride view or something like that, and edit vehicles menu. Uh, you can probably find it on here somewhere. Just under something you kind of like, whatever we named it as. Uh, but, Spawn by vehicle model name, Econoline, and I think my game just crashed. Yep, which means it's too high quality, which means we have to go back into Z Modeler and um, optimize some things, probably just the body shell or the chassis or something. Um, but then it will run. Uh, I'm gonna go optimize it and re export it, and I will see you guys in game when it actually spawns. Peace.